Hey guys, how are you? Welcome to my channel. I don't like saying all that stuff. You know what I mean? It's like, y'all know it's my channel. You know who I am if you're not new. If you're new, then hi. Hang on tight. <laughs> but, um, I don't know. It just gets tiresome to hear it, you know, from, and I just don't want to be like a broken record and all that. So, that is just basically self-explanatory. You know, everybody's welcome to my videos and, um, you know, good, bad, ugly, whatever. So, but anyway, I have a Dollar Tree haul and I will say an update on the dog. I haven't seen Pinecone. That's what I nicknamed him. That's not his real name. But, um, so I haven't seen him. Um, I, you know, I leave my room. I go to the back door. I go to the front door. I left out three dog biscuits and come to find out I didn't get like the big ones because he's he could probably eat the bigger ones but I just got like the medium size they're like about that long and they're kind of thin so I figured that way if I get that size and the dog you know I, I really believe I don't want this to be true I'm hoping that the owner fixed the situation and you know the dog is safe and at home because like I said it was in great condition um, you know, like the fur was beautiful. The, the, the body mass was, you know, what I figured was great. Um, I mean, I didn't look all at the dog's teeth or whatever, but you know, I mean, it just seems like it was well cared for, but, um, so I don't know, I might have to get Eric to knock on the door to be like, you know, do you still have your dog? You know, is it okay? So at least that way I know, you know what I'm saying? I know it sounds crazy, but I feel like the dog is a part of my family, even though it's not my dog, but you know, if worse comes to worse, then I'll have to listen to my heart and do what I gotta do. So anyway, that's the update. I haven't seen the dog in probably two days. The last, when Eric had seen it and took it back, that's the last time that Eric has seen it. I didn't even get to see it on that day because he, um, he took it back without me. And I went, and I really, I, I'm, I'm really angry though um that he did that i mean i guess in one way it was good so that way i wouldn't bond more or look at his you know cute eyes but um in another way it makes me sad because i could have had a picture you know in that memory so if anything ever happened you know i have a picture but i don't have anything anyway so i found this binder it is like a teal color it's coming off blue i don't know why it's doing that but it's just the you know what one inch yeah so i got one of these to put my dies in so, and then somebody had hauled these, or I think it was a haul, but I don't know who it was because I watched like back to back. But these are scented, I, okay, thrifted, I think it was thrifted living. So, these were scented. I don't know if they smell, but they say scented. I don't know if they smell like, you know, what the hey, let's just open them. And then, of course, I took, I bit this one nail off, so now it's like I'm just one nailed have one nail to do all the work hold on okay you didn't have to hear all that wrestling and rustling of of uh oh wow now I'm gonna wish I would have got two of these I will basically put one of each in a I will have to dig and find my sticker books I think I found two I don't know where my other one is but I will have to find um you know what? I just sat here and thought of something. Thank you guys. Just because I did this video. I'm like, you can't find sticker books anymore. Well, why the hey not create my own? Now I feel like I have to run. I could go get one of those um, because I have what made me think of it was that these stickers, I don't know, maybe the smell or something, or I was thinking about my sticker books. I have one and you guys might have it too. It was white and it was about like maybe, where the heck are my fingers? Like maybe that big and it was like a binder and it had like the thick, like really thick sheets. I'm not even, I don't know. They're thick, thick plastic that your, um, you know, the, what do you call it? Like the cards would go in and that you put your stickers on and then you slide them back in, take them out, slide them in. If you guys remember that, I think mine had a bear on it with like writing. I want to say it had a bear on it. I'm not sure. But anyway, so I could do that. You know, like Target has the awesome page protectors, which I have those and um or i have some so i could like make my own stinking sticker book but anyway these are cool they really smell nice so one of these i'm glad i thought about that 
And then I got these, I hemmed and hauled for a second and I thought, you know what, these were so beautiful to me. They look like they were literally like a postage stamp. I mean, if you stare at them enough to me, I don't know, I just thought they were beautiful. And hopefully there are four sheets in here. So I might give my family member one because I figure sometimes, you know, when we mail out mail or whatever, the stupid envelope doesn't want to close. So this way, you know, just a little reinsurance, but not much. And then I really, I did need to grab this. I really didn't. But I was looking for this before. And um, only because if you guys hear me say I don't want to eat, I hate food. It's only because when I eat now, my body is, is like, just doesn't like the food and I, I'm in pain. Not pain, pain, but discomfort. So that's the only reason why you're going to hear me say I don't want to eat or I'm cutting back or whatever or that I need to walk more because of my body and because of my breathing, which I did pretty good in the store. Um, but certain points my breathing is like, what the heck? So, but anyway, with that said, this is why I said that because I did not need this. But I was looking for this before. Well, I was looking for a brownie mix that looked really good and there was a different color but it looked like it was like the same, but like the brownie. See how this one looks like a cookie color? The other one was darker and it had the same cover. So I'm like, really? I'm like, why is that? Why does that look like that? I found some Remington uh, bows. So I got these for my hair because I'm growing my hair out. These are like a leather feel. Well, they don't really smell like leather, but a leather feel and then I got these ones that are more like a fabric and I just thought that was so cute and they oh poop I shouldn't have got these Dag on it these are the stupid um you know them stupid things you got to push in your head these ones just have the you know the little squishy thing squishy thing the little squeezy thing and you just slide them in your hair but anyway these mm, now I'm mad oh you know what I could just take these off and put them on a on one of these um clips like that or a better clip yay and then I don't know why probably just because of the name because I really don't wear these bobby pins I'm like what are they called I got these I'm always wearing these if you can't see it these things these ones so yeah my bangs don't want to be a part of my head anymore I mean my hair I found these. Somebody had hauled these. It was a new person that I saw. Or either that or it was on Instagram. But this is a pot, the, the, the Pons Pure Detox. I'm trying to facial foam. So I got four of these. So hopefully. Oh, that's a bummer. I thought it was going to be like black. I'm like, oh, I'm going to put this black stuff on my face. Oh, it looks great. Now I got it on my nose. I don't really smell a smell, but. Yep, there's three of them. One's in the bag. There was something that I needed in here. I mean, I literally needed. And now I have no flipping idea what the heck it was, but I know that it would have helped me greatly if I could have found the stupid thing. And I looked in all the aisles and I, and I, I, I remembered. I was like, I'm like, Kim, you need something. Something's in here that you need. But my brain wouldn't tell me. This is the reason why, and I've got to wash these because they are crap loaded with glitter. Okay, don't yell at me because I know I probably posted a video or I might have deleted it, you know, about Valentine's and people, Valentine's and people going bananas. The reason I got these, you know what, I didn't even look to see if they were broken or okay or what. The reason I got these is because my sister, the one that I know and you know, lived with because I have three. Look at that. I'm like, um, two of them I don't know. I mean, I know of them. I, I've never talked to them for like two flipping years. I've never talked to them. But anyway, so the one that I do know is, um, and she acts just like the other two, um, never see her. So it's like she has to come over on Saturday. And she told me she had a little something for me. Well, I always made her cookies for Christmas. Well, I'm still not ready for Christmas and it's already done, gone and passed. The same with Thanksgiving. So I thought this was really cute. Plus, I don't think this one had any more of the, um, they didn't have any more of the, the winter ones. So I thought this one was just cute. And it just has the little hearts on it. They had some that had, well, okay, so this has got XO. This one says hugs, which I just now noticed. This one says be mine, but it's not like, it doesn't scream like all this, you know, con um, convectional heart stuff on it. 
whatever you call them things. So anyway, I got two of these, one for me and one for my family member because she wanted to make my aunt some cookies. So she's going to make sugar cookies, old school recipe where you got to fluff them whites, let me tell you. Um, best stinking recipe in the world. But so I got her a container and I got me one. And then I almost yelled y'all because I really, nope, that's the wrong thing. But I did get this. I don't know why. You know, Father's Day is coming up, my, my father's birthday. Let's see, which one is first? I think his birthday is first and then and then Father's Day. So I thought, you know what? Not that he deserves anything. But then I, when I saw that these were little picture frames, they had white and black. They only had one white one and one black one. So I got the black one because I figured, you know, why would he want white, you know? Um, and then I liked it because of that little picture frame. So I could put one of me so I could scare him when he looks at it and then um, maybe another one. Okay, and then my last two items, I'll show you the last one. I talked myself out of this and I thought, you know what, I'm like, I could decorate this and make it really, really pretty. So everybody was hauling it and I just kept loving the way that it looked and I thought, you know what, Kim, you need to grab, you know, grab it. And this thing is like, I wouldn't say it's MDF, but whatever it is, I mean, it could be an MDF form, but it's really, really, you know, kind of um, has good weight to it. I was surprised. I'm like, Dad, you're heavier than I thought. So I got this. I cannot wait to paint it or have fun. You know what? I should have got one for Eric and then had us like design it for each other. <laughs> I told the man in there, the man who knows me, I guess he doesn't know me by name, but he was like, oh, you're in here all by yourself. And I'm thinking, yeah. I said, I haven't fed Eric to the alligators yet. And he goes, no, you haven't. I don't know. That man talks to me sometimes and then he doesn't. It's like, you know what? Make up your mind. Okay, so this is what I really, really wanted when I saw everybody hauling this. And I didn't know that it was just plastic, but I love it anyway. I think they only have like two or three left at my store. And it was all the way down in the bottom shelf. So, I got this. And that's it, I think. $16 worth of stuff. I don't even see where the heck it all is. But I'm going to have to count it to make sure I didn't like leave a bag behind. Because I guess she, the cashier has like family issues and... You know, when they have family issues, they forget what they're doing, but, <clears throat> so I don't think it's anything that, you know, came up, like, unexpectedly. I think it already happened, but, you know, it's dramatizing. So, anyway, guys, I have not eaten, and it's 150. I didn't even eat a Kit Kat bar. I'm like, no, you're not. I'm like, you ain't having no stinking Kit Kat bar. So, I'm like, nope, nope, and there are so many people out. Today is Thursday, y'all. Thursday! And it is like blazing with people. It's like, don't y'all work? I would if I had a job, so I wouldn't know about it. But there's so many people in my city, in my in my state. I don't know how much big my state is, but in my city, it's too many daggone people. <laughs> Good. Everybody comes here because I think they get handouts. I, don't, I want some handouts. You know what I'm saying? That must be nice. But any who's. I don't know. It takes you an hour to make a left hand turn to get out of the to get out of the one street, you know, that's down from my street, so it's just crazy. But anyways. So I was tickled. I just really wish I would have been tickled if I had found what the heck I wanted. You know what I'm saying? Like what I needed. Because I get excited when I need something and it can benefit me, like it can help instead of, you know, just buying something like you know, this, for example, well, not this one, because I can use this, but like the love signs and whatever, um, or like I needed these to put cookies in. So, yeah, but I don't know what that thing was. I was going to get the, um, vacuum seal bags. I did have some and my other ones from, uh, whatever I got them from Kmart. I want to go to Kmart, but don't even ask me what I wanted. So I'm not going to go there because I don't know what I wanted. Um, I need to write this down. You know, when when you get 40, life takes a turn. You know what I'm saying? It really takes a turn. I, if I could get my foot to my butt, I kick myself a hundred times for, for wanting to, you know, grow up. I'm too grown up now. <laughs> but anyway, um, I, yeah, but I really, I really need to make a list because there was something I thought I wanted at Kmart, whether it was for me or something that Eric could use or something. And then I was saying something to you all, and I don't know what the heck it was. That's how my brain my brain works. I have so much in my head, it's not even funny. 
if you all knew, if you if anybody could see what the inside of my brain, my head looks like, forget my brain, what my whole head looks like, they'd be like, Kim, how do you get up in the morning? How do you remember to breathe and blink your eyes and blow your nose and, you know, how do you live? But, um, well, whatever it was, if I, you know, what, I try to rewatch my video. I've deleted a lot of my videos because I don't like being in my videos. I just feel like I look like a moron, so I just delete them all. But here I am again looking like another moron. <laughs> But anywho, um, yeah, I don't know y'all. I'm trying to think what it was, but I, I can't remember what it was. It was something. I don't know if it was something I was going to say. And I don't know what's all over my window. It looks like somebody sprayed soda on my window. Um, but I'm over here behind um, the uh, Goodwill is over that way. And then the Dollar Tree is like way back that way. So it's like the Dollar Tree and Goodwill are right next to one another that's basically all that's in here well on back here and then up further I don't know why I'm telling you all this but you got a one of them auto zone or some like car place no I think they do tires I don't know it's not auto zone because auto zone just sells you stuff I think but whatever the place that does tires tires and um then there's a well there was a Papa John's but now I think Domino's took it over so I don't know. I feel like if I sit here and keep running my mouth, then I can tell you guys what I am or what I wanted or what I was looking for. But I guess I'll go. I don't want to make this any longer than what it is. Oh, do you all see what I did in my eyebrows? Can you all like flip and see that? <laughs> I jacked them boys up, didn't I? I like, they look thicker. But I mean, I like just, you should not, if you have, if you wear glasses for distance, you really should not, and you do your own eyebrows, you should not take pointy tweezers or when you're upset, no, wear your glasses, be cool and calm because, but I like thin eyebrows. This is probably the thinnest maybe that I've ever had in my life. And then like this goes like has a dip and then it goes up and I'm like, what are you doing? <laughs> Anyways. But it's funny because every time I look in the mirror, I crack up at myself. So, but you know, okay, let me, I want, I want to, I do want to say this since I said about my eyebrows, you guys may hear me, um, you know, talk about myself. Um, I might even laugh about it because I do think it's funny and that's how I am. I'm not hurting myself. I'm not harming myself. It gets on Eric's nerves. Like I called myself yesterday a raccoon because I just got my, um, I was able to, you know, get my uh, hair dyed for Christmas. So not for Christmas, but you know, had the funds to do it finally. And, but my hair was like so nasty with, you know, the, the white coming out, you know, we just went from brown to white and, um, you know, I just, I do that, you know, I mean, it is what it is. Like I posted a picture on Instagram and said, you know, because my, I had my hoodie, even though I, well, I am fat, you know, it is what it is. Eric, I'm prob probably morbidly, morbidly obese, whatever. Cause that's how the doctors always say it. Mine doesn't, but you know, others do, but see like my face and it looks like I have acorns in my mouth and my cheeks cause they're so big. But anyway, see what I'm saying? Like I do that. My time's almost up, but, um, but you know, don't like let it like you know bother you because to me it's funny you know I don't get all depressed after I do it or whatever I just think it's funny I like cracking jokes on myself maybe I do it because you know maybe other people will and I do it before them and then it, they don't have the time or space or they're like dad you know she's already done it for me I don't know whatever but you know it's just natural and I think it's funny and I I can't help it that you guys don't um I mean, you know, we all think differently or whatever, but that's how I get my laughs and stuff. And if I have to use myself to get a laugh, then I do. Oh, well, but um, anyway, guys, I'm going to talk to you guys later. Didn't mean to make this 19 minutes, but I did. You know, it might be days or weeks before you see me again. Look, my turkey gobbler. Look at that. That's just, mm. need some tape, y'all. Get some tape. <laughs> anyway. But um, I'll talk to you guys later. Have a blessed one. Oh, what is today before my time runs out? Today's Thursday. So happy Thursday, guys. Bye.